Hi everyone, so today I'm back with a new video and I'm going to be re reviewing e.l.f. Cosmetics brand new camo liquid blush. This is what it looks like right here. I picked up the shade Dusty Rose. These retail for $7 at Target, Ulta, and on e.l.fcosmetics.com. I was lucky enough to find mine at Target today, this morning. So I wanted to slap on some really quick, like five minute makeup and get this review out as soon as possible. So I have the claims on Ulta's website all about this uh, product right here. And if you guys are not familiar, I was never a blush person. So now that I'm like fully into blush and um, been exper experimenting a lot more recently, I had to pick this up and I wanted to review it for you guys at ASAP. So if you are interested in my thoughts on this blush and my reviews and um, wear time and everything of that nature, please continue to keep on watching. Okay, so starting off, this is what it looks like right here. I love the packaging. You get 0 0.13 fluid ounce of product. I will open it right here. And... I love the packaging. It's like very sleek. I know a lot of people were saying that these are a dupe for Selena Gomez's Rare Beauty Look at Blushes. So here's what the packaging looks like. Super cute and very tiny. I was expecting it to be bigger with the packaging, but as you can tell, the packaging is a lot bigger than the actual product inside, but which is not a bad thing. Like if this works, like I'm not mad at how much you get. So I'm going to read the claims off of Elf Cosmetics website right now. So it says, this is a long lasting liquid blush that delivers a high pigment pop of color to cheeks with a dewy finish, which I'm, I've been really into um, glowy blush lately, so I'm very happy that this has a dewy finish. It says that it is infused with hyaluron hyaluronic acid, rose flower water, and hibiscus flower extract. The skin-loving dewy blush is lightweight and blends out into a soft finish. Um, added perk, the rounded grooved applicator makes application a breeze while our liquid blush brush helps you blend like an elfing pro. So I wanted to actually get the um, the blush brush that comes with this, but they didn't have it at my local Target. I know they had it at Ulta, but I didn't have a chance to go there today. So um, what I'm going to do is I already applied a layer of foundation, right? And I set this side with powder, this side I left without. So the, the side that I set with powder, I'm going to apply it with my, how I've been loving to apply blush lately is with my flat top um, foundation brush and this is like a really old brush i've had for a long time but i feel like this using this type of a brush is like the best way to truly just um, um build up the product and to blend in I, i've been i've been loving br using brushes like this lately so i'm going to use that on the side that i already um powdered and then on this side that i didn't powder i'm just going to go in with my elf total face sponge so as i mentioned i have the shade dusty rose so i'm going to I'm going to do some swatches of this later, but I will do a little bit of a swatch on the back of my hand so you guys can see. And oh my gosh, this is so super pigmented. Like, this is what it looks like right here. And I love, absolutely love tones like this. Like, this is right up my alley. And here's what Dusty Rose looks like. It looks like a really beautiful shade. And you can see the dewiness, like, as I'm moving my hand back and forth. So, um, I'm going to take a dot. Like, they say it's buildable, so... I'm going to apply a dot of this right here. We'll see how much, how quickly if you can build that up. So I'm going to go in with my flat top brush and this is the side that I powdered earlier. So I'm going to just work this into my skin. And as you guys, and, I, and as I said, guys, you can already see that using a brush like this, I feel like you, you get a lot more control when it comes to like the placement and everything and wow. This is beautiful. This is really, really beautiful. And you guys see that I only applied a dot. And this is, and this is over powder. And you can see the doing this. Like, look, look when I move my skin back and forth. Like, I didn't apply a highlighter, um, purposely because I wanted to see how much of a glow that this actually gives the skin. So, very, very beautiful so far. Okay. And then on this cheek, I'm going to apply another dot. And this is the side that I didn't set yet going to apply another dot just like right here we'll put like a little bit like that and then we'll blend it in with my skin but so far i am very impressed with how this is turning out i feel like the formula it's very very easy to just it's it's very blendable and i'm not having any issues with blending it out whatsoever like this is really really looking beautiful and personally i mean it's blending out nicely with a sponge but let me add a little bit more because i don't think i applied I don't think I applied enough to this sheet, but let me just go in with a little bit more. I'm actually going to apply a little bit more on both sides so you guys can see the pigmentation. But so far, so good. This color is right up my alley. Definitely the type of a tone that I'm very much drawn to. I love that like flush 
look to the to the cheeks and the face. So, and well, I think I applied a little bit too much, but yeah, so far so good. It's looking beautiful on the skin. No issues with blending. Um, everything about this is the type of tone that I that I gravitate towards anyway. And you can tell, guys, like this is so beautiful. And for only being seven dollars, like I'm very happy that I decided on experimenting more with blush because I would really be sad if I was missing out right now. But I am not noticing a difference at all when it comes to how it's applying. No, um, with I'm actually preferring how it looks better by applying it with the brush and with the powdered mm -hmm. side. Like this face, this side actually looks better to me than this side. But overall, I'm just gonna go in and blend everything together with my brush. Okay, and here's how it looks blended out with the brush. I just decided on blending everything together. Um, let me tell you, I am very impressed. This is a beautiful blush. Um, easy to uh, to work with, very pigmented, like a little bit goes a long way. But what I like about this formula is that even though it's super pigmented, you can build it up until until like the intensity that you like. Because you can see like it, even though I applied a lot, it still is very easy to blend out. And the color is absolutely beautiful. And it leaves a, um, a luminosity behind on the skin. Like even if you, you're not the type of person that um, doesn't like to apply highlighter, this right here, you can tell, it just creates a, leaves a very beautiful sheen behind on the skin. For $7, I cannot recommend these honestly to you guys enough. Like I'm not going to have a, um, that much time to wear it, um, do, to do like an actual wear test. I'm kind of in a rush today, if you can tell. But my thoughts are, so far I'm giving this a 10 out of 10. This blush is beautiful. They have nine different shades available at Target. So I'm like, there's definitely something for everyone. I think I'm definitely going to go back and pick up another shade. And um, when it comes to application wise, I feel like using a flat top brush is your best bet because the sponge, it then it did tend to um, shear it out just a little bit more. But when you pack it on with a densely packed brush like this, it just made application that much more. It's a way easier and just, um, you know, it was it just placed the product exactly where I wanted it. So. Yeah, I cannot recommend these to you guys enough. Beautiful products from Elf Cosmetics. Like, I love Elf Cosmetics. And for $7, you cannot beat it. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my review of the brand new Elf Camel Look Blushes. They are beautiful. And I'm going to include some swatches before I go. But, um, yeah, um, once again, thank you guys so much for the love and support. You all mean the absolute world to me. And I will be back to record some more videos very soon. Love you. Okay, I wanted to show you guys how they look in daylight before the sun goes down. But you can tell... This blush is beautiful and I just love everything about it. And please excuse my facial hair. Like I have not shaved. I had no time today, but as of now, like I can say I am in love with these. The formula is beautiful, lightweight. Everything about this formula, um, I cannot honestly recommend enough. Elf did an incredible job with these. Um, yeah, just absolutely in love. Kim, this is what the shade Dusty Rose looks like right here. This color is beautiful. Right up my alley, like I've always been into tones like this. Um, and you can see the luminosity that is in the formula. Like however they formulated this, they did an amazing job. And if you're not like, you know, you're not the type of person that likes powder products. Um, this blush is definitely for you. And let me just really quick, let me put my phone down like really, really fast here. I'm just going to like sheer it out just to show you guys. So here's what it looks like when it's slightly blended out on my, the back of my hand. You can just see the luminosity. Um, yeah, this formula is beautiful. Um, I cannot say it enough. Definitely, definitely, if you can find these in Ulta and Target right now, go out and pick these up. You will not be disappointed for $7. Yeah, I am beyond impressed. So I'm definitely going to pick up another shade. So yeah, thank you guys once again for the love and support. And I will talk to you very soon.